It's pretty much the first thing I do when I get up in the morning and it's pretty much the last thing I do at night. I just find it really calming and just the thing I like to do best. I think when you're gardening, you take your mind off things and you tend to forget about any troubles or worries that you have. In a classroom, we feel like we're more on the edge, but then when we come out here in the garden, it's just a calming atmosphere with everyone like helping out with watering, planting. It's just a nice feeling. So I've been really passionate about nature since I was small and actually um, I've taken for granted that I've actually had a lot of space when I was small and lived in the country and that has a huge impact on your mental health. So I wanted to bring that into the school. We set up a uh, greenhouse and some raised beds over here and it was amazing. We immediately had kids who were coming down to the garden and feeling very relaxed and happy and chilled. The school garden used to be very like, bland and there wasn't anything there when I joined the school. And then when we started planting all the different plants, it got really colourful and really nice to look at. And it really cheers me up when I go down. My students who now have their own beds over at Elgin, they just, they've taken so much ownership of it and it's made such a difference to them to have something to be proud of. It just gives them a sense of achievement and ownership and responsibility and their behaviours really improved. When Hammersmith Academy approached us about doing a project in the garden, it was an ideal fit. And a lot of people who come to the centre don't have gardens themselves. So this is somewhere for them to come and enjoy. And it's just an, an environment that's conducive to, to uh, a social engagement for people, and especially with younger people as well. I think it's just great to have uh, a mix of uh, you know, different generations working together. So um, when we were here last year, we had uh, one of the residents, Richard, in his wheelchair helping out um, planting up the, the vegetable planters here and uh, working side by side with the, uh, with the students. I think people just feel better in gardening because of a sense of well-being. I think it's very important. I just like being in the fresh air, so I'm very happy here. The kids have taken such ownership of this because they've actually they've done it from scratch. Everything that you see in the garden, they have done themselves. What's really interesting for me is if you ask most young people, do you want to spend some time in the garden or do you want to do some gardening? The answer will be probably no. And when a tutor group comes down initially, they come down and they're slightly reluctant for the first 10 minutes and then we pair them up with um, some student mentors. And then within like five minutes, they're gardening and enjoying it and doing a range of different activities. And by the end of the session, they're like, when's the next day? And by the end of the second day, they're like, is this it? Can we get some more? 